Hello everyone, Tegan Blade here, and we're gonna play some Legend of Zelda, The Ocarina of Time, an old classic, a personal favorite beyond all reason and measure. And I'm so happy I'm gonna have the privilege to share my experience with you. I have not played this game in a while, therefore I may seem very much noobish as I do, so I'd like to add too, I even snuck the legendary master quest and so you shall not just be seeing this but I'll be playing this normally but you'll see once in a while a video of the new dungeons underneath the master quest which are where the dungeons have changed up so let me just change up here before this goes into a sneak preview thing now the link file is my regular file but we're not going to use that I hate. I've already gotten the sword and everything. So we're going to sit back and relax in the vast, deep forest of Hyrule. Long have I served as the guardian spirit. I am known as the Deku Tree. The children of the forest, the Karari, live here with me. Each Karari has his or her own guardian fairy. However, there is one boy who does not have a fairy. Ooh, you sound cold. Cutscene. I miss these graphics. This was like the high intention kind of graphics back in the day because this was Nintendo's first 3D game and it was beautiful. Hello! Mr. Scary Man chasing after a girl. Pedophile. Nave, Nave, where art thou? Come hither. O oh, Nave the fairy, listen to my words and the words of the Deca tree. Dost thou sense it? The climate of evil descending upon this realm. A malevolent force is even now we're mustering to attack our land of Peru. For long. For so long, the Karaki Forest, the source of life, has stood as a barrier, deterring outsiders and maintaining the order of the world. But before this tremendous evil power, even my power is as nothing. It seems the time has come for the boy without a fairy to begin his journey. The youth whose destiny it is to lead home the path of justice and truth! Nay, go now, by knowing your friend, and guide him to me. I do not have much time left. Fly, nay, fly! The fate of the forest! Nay, the world depends on ye! We Vertigo time! Woo! What a beautiful place! Hello. Hello! Hey! Wow, I can still remember these. Alright. Yep, that's us. That's the house, and. Oh! Yeah. Forget, we're working with the idiot fairy. Alright. We're working with the special ed fairy. <clears throat> Hello? Hello? Hello, Tegan, wake up! The great Deku Tree wants to talk to you. Tegan, get up! Dude, don't you see him sleeping? Hey, come on! Can Hyrule's destiny really depend on such a lazy boy? Yes. 
<laughs> you finally woke up! I'm Nave the Fairy! The great Gigatree asked me to be your partner from now on! Nice to meet ya! The great Gigatree has summoned you! Let's go! Get going! Right now! Let's go! Yes, of course. Because I, the lonely boy in the forest, I'm just talk to a giant freaking boy tree. The Karate Farms. You here? Hi, Tegan! Yeah, bitches be coming to my treehouse. Wow, a fairy! Finally, a fairy came to you, Tegan! Wow, that's great news! I'm so happy for you! Now you're a true Karari! Tegan, is that right? The Great Digga Tree has summoned you? It's quite an honor to talk to the Great Digga Tree! I'll wait for you here! Get going! Go see the Digga Tree! Alright, alright. Rolling, rolling, rolling. They see me rolling. You, out of the way! Out of the way! Oh wait, this is the uh, asshole kid. Hey you, Mr. Nelfay! We're the business with the great digger tree! We got a fairy and not even a real man! What? You got a fairy? What? Say what? The great digger tree actually summoned you? What? Why would he summon you and not the great? I do! This is your fun, I don't believe it. You aren't even fully equipped yet. How do you think you're going to help the Great Digger Tree without a, both a sword and a shield? Ready. What? You're right. I don't have my equipment ready, but... If I want you to pass through here, you should at least equip a sword and a shield. Uh -huh. See? Alright, prick. Fucking power trip, much Obama. Uh, listen, that great Geeko tree has some in jail. Please come with me. Well, right now, freaking Obama, freaking wannabe, right there. He's... Let's get some cash real fast. I know I gotta buy. I gotta buy shields. Alright, gotcha. Us! I, I have six! I'm getting richer! It's kinda weird. This game kind of uh, encourages kids to run around in people's home, break, break their pottery, and try to steal their money. It's really weird if you think about it. Have any of you ever thought about that? This game is practically like the beginning idea of, like, you know, ch childhood B and E. Because, I mean, you're playing a child and you just walk into people's houses and just start stealing. I mean, no one stopped me right there. I just walked into that person's house, broke some of their potter, their pottery, and then just went, "Oh, yep, okay, I'm moving." Oh, what's this? The house of the great Mario, boss of the Karari. Yeah, right. I'm gonna take a giant fucking stool bit on your bed. Great leader of the Karari. I just. Stealing your shit on you. And no one's stopping me. You don't even have a bed. How can you be a leader? I have a bed. You have a podium. Can you sleep on your fucking podium with your freaking jackass?
Oh, I see money up there. Uh, yeah, right here. I mean, nowadays kids will never know the general idea of how awesome this was to all of a sudden just turn a cartridge game to be a 3D game out of all things. And, and play something as awesome as this. It's it's breathtaking. Alright. I know there would be some money I know this way. And I'm born! Well, I Ow. I meant to do that. You all saw that. I meant to do that. Alright, here we go. One of the most ethical, magical parts of the game. You've got the Karari sword. This is a hidden treasure in the Karari, but you can borrow it for a while. Be sure to practice with it before we can really fight. Yes. We're just gonna save the progress right now. Yay, I have a sword! What better way to start an adventure besides giving a little kid a sword? It's kind of funny if you think about it. It's like, okay, we're gonna make a game. We're gonna play as a kid. And you're gonna be able to break into people's heads. Steal their, uh, steal their hard-earned money or whatever money they obtain and acquire throughout their lifetime. And then you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna step it up. We're gonna let them play around with weapons, swords, slingshots, the little Bart Simpson of video games. Ah, wait, ah. Hey, Tegan, look this way. You can look over here. So Z, talk with me today. Yeah, that's it. That's how you use a fairy. I could use a San Francisco joke in that one. But I'll behave. Hey, 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 hey. You guys want to see a secret? I bet you guys never knew about this. Yeah, yeah, I got a shield. Now I'm somewhat special. No, I don't want to buy anything else. Alright, there you go. I'm fully equipped with everything. That bastard has to let me buy now. Oh, water! My, my mortal enemy, because you can't really freaking move in it. If you want to see the great de <clears throat> If you want to see the great digger tree, you should at least be equipped with a short shield. Hey, what, what's that? You have a DP shield? Wait, 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 what's that? Is that a Karari sword? Good grief! Fucking Charlie Brown. Well, even with all that stuff, a whip is still a whip, huh? I, the Great Miner, will never accept you as one of us. Shoot, how did he get there to be in favor of Ciara and the Great Tiki Tree, huh? Grumble, grumble, grumble. I'll kill you. Freaking fat girl. Chop, chop, chop. Whoa. You got a thank you, church. Thank you, stick. Great thank you, tree. Great thank 
Great, thank you, Tree. I'm back. I don't even know what fucking voice I use for her. <clears throat> Nave is a girl, by the way. Oh, Nave. <clears throat> oh, Nave. Thou hast returned. Tegan, welcome. Listen carefully to what I, the great Deku Tree, am about to tell thee. Thy slumber that these past moons must have been restless and full of nightmares. As the servants of evil gain strength, a vile climate pervades the land and causes nightmares to those sensitive to it. Verily, thou hast felt it. Hugin, the time has come to test thy courage. I have been cursed. I need you to break the curse with your wisdom and courage. Thus thou have the courage enough to undertake this task. Courage, yes. Where the hell do you get wisdom? You're asking a ten-year-old for wisdom! Oh, uh, then enter brave Tegan and thou too, Nave. Nave the fairy, thou must aid Tegan. And Tegan, when Nave speaks, use that button as well to hear her words of wisdom. Hey! Hello! Listen! Those are the only things she says. Well, fine. We'll go in here. You know, for a talking tree that's living, does he eat people? Is that is he actually just tricking me to go into his mouth? Uh, I think this may be a trick, but okay, we'll roll, roll this. We'll roll. Inside the Deku tree. Hey! Freaking rat. Yay, I got. Oh, yeah, shit. I got nuts in the shit now. So let's see here. Who will be that? No. You'll be that. You'll be that. And I'll do that because I tend to freaking spasmically. S what? Look, look, T. Look, look, T. You can see down below in the web. No, I probably should mess around my controls. I actually have to set up backwards. But hey! Listen! Look at this wall. The vines growing on it look rough surface. Maybe you can climb it, Tegan. Then maybe everyone can see up my skirt when I do it. Hey, spiders. Just what I need to freaking see. Or, not spiders, but skeletons. Skelantulas. Don't worry, I'll kill you guys soon enough. Oh shit. Alright, cool. That was just awesome, I just totally missed and survived. Who the hell puts a ten year old up to the journey of trying to save the world? You can open doors by standing in front of them and press it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It takes the action. Oh, forget. Ow, ow, ow. Forget me, Bowser. If I give you a clue, will you let me go? When you jump off high places, if you hold full, you can roll on the ground when you land. It won't hurt. It won't get hurt when you fall. I can't guarantee you it'll work, though, to put the really, really high heat heat heat. But try it if you're feeling bold. And screw you, too, buddy. Oh, it's in here. 
Wait. Um. It's dude. Oh yeah. Uh, fucking slingshot. It's a fairy slingshot. What's so special about a fairy slingshot? It's different from a regular slingshot. Is the fact that it remains inside a tree. What kind of tree? What kind of tree has a slingshot in it? Just random freaking slingshot. Even more so. This this stay with me for a minute. What kind of tr living tree has doors inside of it? And all in these rooms and everything like that. Can someone tell me what kind of freaking tree this is? They have all this shit. I want to apologize if my name seems very off. Oh, look! Seeds! Thank you, seeds. You know, I have a question. What? Uh, what, what is it? The decor are those the things that are just all over the place. Then, yeah, no. We're just gonna climb up here because apparently that's all that we need to do right now is climb up. Oh. Uh oh. That's no good. Wait, was there even something even important for me to even want to come in here for? No. Because if I remember correctly, this is the compass. So this was a waste of time going in here. But hey, you know what? Boom. There you go. For some of your nostalgic people who like hearing that. Give me your stick, boy. There's a gold, there's a gold skull, gold skull down. I care not for the fruits of his nature. That almost time to valley. Nope. Ow. That didn't work out like you were supposed to. That did. Yay! Oh, two gold skedeldons here. You destroyed a gold skedel- Uh, you know what, I don't know how to say it. okay, so all you freaking people there watching are like, Oh, no, no, that's how you say it. No, 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 You know what, I am sorry. Okay? I am- Apologize for my unknowingness on how to pronounce certain words. My education was not that good. What can I say? This is where it starts getting more pissy on me. So please bear. That's about to happen. If I get this on the first try, I'll be happy. Alright, good.
Yes, I found you. I caught you. Please forgive me, Master. I'll never do it again if you spare me. I'll teach you something cool. You'll never be able to beat my brothers up ahead unless you punish them in the proper order. The order is two, three, one. Twenty-three is number one. Do you think I'm a traitor? Yes. Backstabber. Those guys depended on you. You know what? They're going to be punished because of you. I'm going to let them know you told me. I'm going to let you know they told me. You told me. After you get into the water, you can hold. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. I bet there's some interesting stuff in the water. No shit, like maybe a switch? So getting dead right there. Stand next to this block and grab hold of it with A. Well, I think you can push or whatever. Alright, I understand. Yes. Move along. Move along. Pay attention to the action icon. Yes. Now look at this thing. This thing's like twice the size of me. Unless this thing is made of like hollow wood, there should be no reason I should be able to do this. And look how much trouble I'm having! Funnier thing is the same thing when you're an adult in this game. It's like, uh... Honestly, what's up with the realms? You're inside a living being! How come... Can anyone else, like, explain this to me? And how come inside a living being like a Diego tree is broken off into rooms inside of him? Alright, we're almost done with this. Almost done. Ow. My foot fell asleep. That's how intense this game is. It makes your foot fall asleep. Some of these dungeons, believe it or not, are actually so easy to get through as long as you know the key places you need to be. Like, um, there's a well in this game. And literally, I only have to be in, I can be in that well for, I think I was in the well for maybe three minutes. I can be in the well for three minutes. Whee! So I'm going to see how far I can make this video last, oh, oh, here they are. Twin, two, three, one. Ah, shit, that sucks. One. Fuck!
Come on. How did you know how secret? How irritating is it not even going to reveal the secret of the queen to you? In order to administer the coup de grace, strike with your sword while she's stunned. Oh, Queenie, I'm so sorry about that. Alright. Let's do this into the map. And the Dingo Tree did not look that big from outside, where I'm a little, oh, I mean, this could be the root area. Come on, lock it. There we go. Parasite on the rock. Watch this. There we go. Come on. Aha! <laughs> oh, what's this? I killed it, so I took its heart. I am a serial killer, collecting hearts. These are my trophies. All right. Not ending the video just yet. Yeah, we're going to enjoy these little moments. Well done, Tiggy. Thou hast very demonstrated thy courage, and I knew that thou wouldst be able to carry out my wishes. Now, I have yet more to tell you. Wouldst thou want to listen? I just improvise the rest of it, cause God knows you know. Ah, shit, I said yes. Now listen carefully. A wicked man! A oh, wicked man in the desert has cast this dreadful curse upon me. What, to have a building inside of you? Yeah, that was the guy in the dream. This evil man ceaselessly uses his vile sorcerer's powers and his search for the sacred realm that is connected to Hanul. For it is in that sacred realm that one would find the divine relic, the Triforce, which contains the essence of the gods. Before time began, before the spirits of life existed, three golden goddesses descended upon the chaos that was Hyrule. Din, the goddess of power. Neru, the goddess of wisdom. And Flora, the goddess of courage. Fuck you people who are, who are correcting me right now. I know I can't pronounce her names.
in. With her strong flaming arms, she cultivated the land and created the red earth. Now, poured her wisdom onto the earth and gave the spirit of love the world. And flower. With her rich soul produced all life forms who would uphold the law. <clears throat> the three goddesses, their labors completed, departed for the heavens. And the golden sacred triangles remain at the point where the goddesses left the world. And since then, the sacred triangles have become the basis of our Ruth's providence. And with the resting place of the triangles has become the sacred realm. Thou must never lend the desert man black armor to lay his hands upon the sacred triforce. Thou must never suffer that man with his evil heart to enter the sacred realm of legend. That man who cast the death curse upon me has sapped my power. Because of that curse, my end is nigh. Though through your valid efforts to break the curse you were successful, I was doomed before you started. So what was the point of that? So, I will pass away soon. But do not grieve for me. We, well, you know what? You kind of threw me in your mouth saying, Hey, if you did this, I'll be safe. But now, you know what? You just kind of fucked me. What was that for? Was that some kind of cruel, senseless humor that you did just before you died? You know, haha, let me get one of these kids to go inside me. Break the curse, but I'll be dead anyway. I have been able to tell you of this important matters. This is Hyrule's final hope. Tegan, go now to the Hero Castle. There, thou will certainly meet the Princess of Destiny. Take this stone with you, the stone that the man wanted so much that he cast the curse upon me. Oh look, it's Jory! How come the frickin' tree has frickin' jewelry? You got the cry emerald. This is the spiritual stone of the forest, now entrusted to you by the good TV chair. The future depends on thee, Tegan. Thou art courageous. I am the fairy. Help Tegan carry out my will. I entreat ye name. Good bye. Dude. Let's go to the Hyrule Castle here again. Goodbye, Great Deku Tree. He can't hear you. He just turned gray in front of you. Right. Get out of my way. Hey, Tegan. Hey, Tegan. What did you do? The great Deku Tree, did he? Die? How could you do things like that? It's all your fault. I hope you get chlamydia on chlamydia. Oh, you're leaving. Are you the Joker's daughter? I knew that you would leave the forest someday, Tegan. Because you are different from me and my friends. Is it because I was a ten-year boy forced into a tree? Sought out to freaking do some kind of sick 
last minute deed for a freaking dying tree. But that's okay because we'll be friends forever, won't we? Are you hitting on me? I want you to have the Sakurina. Please take good care of it. Yay, you gave me a flu. Thank you. You have received the fairy ocarina. This memento from Sierra. Yep, I shall Ow. select it. You can play different notes with A. Beta quite yeah. When you play my ocarina, I hope you will think of me and come back to the forest to visit. Okay then, you are freaking me out. Come on! Woo! I love you. Come back. Oh, uh, I feel what a beautiful place. This is where the rest of our story shall begin on the next video. Well, I'm going to leave this video off here. If you enjoyed this video, please show some love with some thumb. This is Tegan Blade signing off, and I will see you all in the next video, and I shall be making more of these videos, because you know what? I really like this game, and I just want to make the videos. So anyway, show some love with some thumb, subscribe, go to Tegan Blade, you can find me on Facebook.com backslash Tegan Blade, Twitter.tv backslash Tegan Blade. This is Tegan Blade signing off, and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye!